just welcome to our blog. Um, this is about Sam and Tiara Ha's wedding on Thursday. They got um, married just before Easter, which gave them the whole weekend to um, enjoy married life. Um, we had a great time. Started off in town with getting ready photos. It was um, the whole wedding. I think was was really in, in memory as well of um, Tiara Ha's mother. Here's a photograph of her with um, a locket around her dress that we took. Um, yeah, we, we did some getting ready shots and then we went round to Parliament Buildings and um, the Law School. And that was great fun, wasn't it, Rach? Yeah, got some great high-speed video as well. It was cool. Yeah. them running. I thought that was really funny. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Um, here's a few couple of photos here we took around um, the Parliament Buildings. This one is of um, Sam running past. I just uh, laid down on my belly and slowed down the shutter speed and got uh, Tiara Hart to just lean up against the building. I love the blue and the texture of the stone and then the movement and um, yeah, that was, that was good fun. And then um, the next one is of these guys just being right next to a building. I really like natural, the natural photos, don't like posing people too much. Um, and they had a good time doing that and of course we went straight on to the law school after that and I got this photo of um, Tiara Hart going up the steps in the law school, really low light in there, and this is all just natural light, no flash, um, very dark. Um, we had a few onlookers as yeah, well. <laughs> a few onlookers, we interrupted everyone doing their study, being a Thursday, but I'm sure they didn't mind. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> After we went from the law school, we went to um, went up to the beach, because they got married up in Paraparam at their father's place, and um, the beach up there, we, we stopped off just before the, the ceremony, and mm. uh, took a few shots of, um, them just walking up and down the beach using the veil as well. Here's a couple of shots here. I just love this photo. Just by accident, the veil flew up and created a bit of a love heart. And uh, with strong backlight, we used strong flash to fill in the light. And um, and then again, down on my hands and knees and doing that a lot <coughs> lately, crawling along the sand on my belly. And shot this one with the Capti Island in the background um, with these guys just, uh, just hanging around, really. It's quite a natural photo. Mm. After we went to the beach, we went to the ceremony, and their ceremony was in the garden, and it was a really nice place. Yeah, um, beautiful. You know, they had a marquee, huge garden. The marquee was right down the end, and it hardly filled up any space at all in the in the garden. But um, really beautiful setting. They had pergolas, they had um, flowers everywhere, and it was just it was just lovely. Kids they running even around. They had a flag, a few names on it, which was cool. Yeah, they did. Before, so they did. Yeah. I mean, we took some pictures of kids and um, all of the guests and um, just the event, and it was just great fun. Here's a couple of the, the kids that we shot. Here's a, a little boy who's on the bridal party just being inquisitive. And there's a little girl just running around, pushing a pram around. Um, after the ceremony, they had a big marquee, and the whole theme of it was a bit of a fairy tale. They had candles and lights everywhere throughout the whole garden, and it was just beautiful. As the sun went down, it was, it was gorgeous, wasn't it? Mm. And they had lanterns sort of leading you down the path towards the marquee, which was really cool. Yeah, it was beautiful. And not, and they even had fireworks and some sparklers, and here's some sparklers. And um, they're pretty easy to photograph sparklers. They seem quite difficult, but it's, uh, you just got to kick your, your shutter speed fairly slow and get enough ambient light, and away you go. And this one here is um, an HDR photo that we took. Um, and... This is a series of nine photos blended into one um, using HDR. And uh, bride and groom was just sitting still for what seemed like hours trying to get this <laughs> one. But um, yeah, I really wanted to capture the fairy land type um, theme that they had going on. Yeah, they're really nice people. Um, the wedding was very sort of stylish, beautiful and fairy-like. I thought it was a few words to sum it up. Yeah, no, it was awesome. Any tips? Um, well, when we were getting ready, um, Dara was the makeup artist and she did the hair as well. She was really good, really helpful. She had Hollywood tape in her purse just in mm -hmm. case, and that came in quite useful. Also, um, she said Vaseline was really good for dry, cracked lips. Mm -hmm. So that was quite quite interesting. And um, the girls had heel stoppers, which are always great for for wearing on your shoes. You know, the heels don't get damaged and stops you sinking into the grass or sand so yeah. they're really cool yeah. I like the um, they had a pizza wagon there and um, the pizza wagon was serving up 
pizza, obviously, all through the day, but that kept the, the guests entertained um, during the, um, you know, after the service and before the actual reception started, um, kept them well fed, and that is a nice little touch, something different. Um, mm. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Great so, yeah, so overall, Sam and Yaraha, well done. Thank you for inviting us to do your day. It was a great day. We really enjoyed it.